Hello and welcome to this week's episode of Programming Tip of the Week. In this episode, we'll be talking about the donut command. This command can be run by typing in donut in the AutoCAD menu, as is shown here. Press enter, and then you can specify the diameter of the inside donut. The donut ring, you can do a simple in this case, type in something like 100 units. And then you can select the outside diameter of the donut. In this case, we can choose 120 units. And then it generates a representation of a donut using two circular polylines. lines. You can then select the location to place the donut. And as you can see, you will get a donut shaped object on a 2D plane. You can place multiple of them and you get these discs that have the center cut out in the form of another disc that has been removed. You can then press escape or delete to exit this menu that lets you place more discs. So by pressing the escape key as I'm doing now. Now that the discs have been created, you can either leave them as is or you could use them as the basis of forming a three-dimensional form using the extrude function as has been covered in another video. In this case, we can type in ext to run the extrude function, select the donut that you want to be processing, pressing enter, and then entering the height of the extrusion. In this case, we can choose 100 again. Now we can rotate the view to see that it has been extruded 100 units upwards to create a cylindrical shape. We can return to the plan view by typing in the sec p command, and we can see now that there's a cylinder and some donuts that are in the plan view. I we hope this video has been helpful for you with your understanding of AutoCAD, and we look forward to seeing you next week. Thank you.